We would like to take a moment to thank Senator Kira Hoffner, Senator Russ Huxtable, and Representative Stell Parker Selby, who visited the track recently when we had Delaware Standard Bread Breeders Fund races at Bally's Dover. The legislators took a paddock tour with our Delaware Standard Bread Owners Association Executive Director, Sal DiMario, and our DSOA attorney, Rebecca Kidner, to learn about our sport and meet our horsemen and women. They even got up close and personal with the two-time Bally's Dover Horse of the Meat, Penzance Hanover. And speaking of up close and personal, you can't get much more on top of the action than with a ride in the starting car, which all of our legislators just raved about. Was it amazing or was it amazing? It was so amazing. <laughs> I love the horses. I love the way they're like smiling when they're running behind the car. <laughs> and both gentlemen were educating me perfectly. I love it. I, I just want to learn all about it now. <laughs> this is the first time you've done this, correct? First time. Yeah. Never did anything like this in my life. I loved it. Did you expect it to be this incredible, or were you just like, oh, I'm going to go for a ride? And... I don't know what I was expecting, but I, I just love the horses. They're so beautiful. And when you're in the car, you get to get so close to them and actually see them running. I love that. It's so exciting. <laughs> I'm so glad that you came out. Thank you so much. Thank and you. I know we're going to see you back here again. Oh, yeah. We oh, will yeah. see you at the I'm racetrack. I'm to educate myself so I know more next time. <laughs> I love it. And of course, they made an appearance in Victory Lane with one of the DSBF winners, that would be three-year-old pacing colt, Night Terror, on this beautiful final evening of the Bally's Dover meet. Thank you to the legislators for coming out and supporting our important first state agricultural business of harness racing.